Everything stopped. Our work stopped. Our life stopped. I work for a sushi catering company. Craig is a filmmaker. We both lost our jobs in a week. We left Vancouver to stay with Craig's parents on the elk farm. We have no idea when or if we will be able to return. When we arrive, we self-quarantine for two weeks. Saskatchewan feels like another world. I've only been here for a few days before and never in winter. Two weeks of quarantine drift by. Every day I check the news from Japan. Every day seems to get worse. I'm worried about my friends and family. Saskatchewan is frozen. Quiet and calm, as though nothing has happened. It's beautiful. But I feel very isolated. We are all worried for our tiny lives. But time keeps moving. It reclaims everything. The spring is suddenly here. It brings relief. Self-quarantine is over. We can spend time with Craig's parents, Jim and Nancy. It feels so good to be doing things after so much waiting and watching. The days are growing long. The world is coming back to life. It feels like we have purpose again. The smells remind me of my grandfather's farm. I only wish my family were here. In the evening, we walk out in the pasture to check for our caps. I love the sky at dusk. 
It feels like the pandemic is just in our minds, just a story on the internet. Every day on the farm is full of new experiences. Jim and Nancy teach me so much. Marlene has had a baby. I wish I could be there. <laughs> Sometimes waves of sadness come. Nature helps them pass. Nature has a calming rhythm. You can lose yourself in it. around the animals. It makes me feel connected to life. Reality can be tough. but it also gives. Life is still going on. It pushes through. It has no choice. As the days pass, the news is improving. <laughs> The infection rates are dropping. My parents look healthy and happy. It's always hard to say goodbye. I'm learning to love life on the farm. The gardens, the elk, the skies. It's more and more like home. Maybe the pandemic took one word from us. But it also gave new opportunities. Maybe we need a chance to stop.
a chance to consider what is important. Maybe we can find goodness in the dark. Soon we are going to return to the city and all the people and the hot apartment and all the traffic and all the noises. It's hard to imagine going back to the city life. The future is so uncertain. what comes next. A return to our old life seems impossible. Going home feels like a step into the unknown. <laughs>